I am delighted to have a chance to say a few words about this administration's policy, which has been the subject of a good deal of discussion, acrimony, and controversy on wages and prices and profits. Now, I know there are some people who say that this isn't any business of the President of the United States, and, uh, that, uh, what, uh, and who believe that the President of the United States should be the honorary chairman of a great fraternal organization and confine himself to ceremonial functions. But that isn't what the Constitution says. And I did not run for President of the United States to fulfill that uh, office in that way. Harry Truman once said there are 14 or 15 million Americans who have the resources to have representatives in Washington to protect their interests and that the interests of the great mass of the other people, 150 or 60 million, is the responsibility of the President of the United States, and I propose to fulfill it.